to enable.org presents mathematical literacy. We are busy with assembly diagrams, floor plans and packaging and we are now at lesson 4 of this uh, assembly diagrams, floor plans and packaging. We are working with Everything Maths' uh, work, which you can find at everythingmaths.co.za, ZA, even though the work is available completely here on Twin Able's website, but you can register on this website, click on Read a Textbook, and then you will be going to this page, and then click on Re Read Maths Literacy 10. Okay, so we are going to do packaging and models. Right, when items are packed into limited space, like a box, a cupboard or a suitcase, how uh, they are packed uh, often determines on how items can fit into the place. A good example of this is trying to pack everything you need for your school day, like your books or your sports equipment and food, into your school bag or backpack. Your books must not be damaged in the process and you have to be able to carry everything yourself. In the same uh, the same limits apply to posting a package to a friend or a family member. Member, an additional aspect to consider is the cost of the postage, which is regularly determined by weight. Sending an extra container costs extra money as well. If you, uh, if what you are posting is fragile, extra protective material must be packed packed between the items to make sure that they reach the destination hole. Okay, so this is the first example. Vuyu and Sipo's father own a biscuit business called Biscuits for Africa. It is the June July school holidays and to make more pocket money, their father has employed Vuyu and Sipo for one week to help package the biscuits into boxes so that they can be transported to stores. Vuya has to pack small boxes of ginger biscuits into a large into large shipping box, bo uh, boxes for transporting. There are 600 small boxes and Vuya's father tell him he can pack 15 boxes of biscuits into one large ship shipping box. How many large boxes will Vuya need? Sipo has to pack 10 cans of chocolate biscuits into the same size shipping box that Vuya is given. He is told that he can fit 50 cans into one larger box. If there are 500 cans, how many large boxes will Sipu need? If there are each large shipping box costs 550, what will, the cheap, what will be cheaper to pack? The ginger in small boxes or the chocolate biscuits in tins? Sip, Vui and Sipo's father tell them that one large box can hold a maximum of three and a half kilograms. If each small box of ginger biscuits weighs 200 grams, remember there are 1,000 grams in a kilogram, how many small boxes can Vuyu pack into a bigger box without exceeding the weight limit? If each can of chocolate biscuits weighs... 300 grams, how many cans can Sipu pack into a bigger box without exceeding the weight limit? The boy's father order new large shipping boxes that are 45 centimeters long and 16 centimeters wide. If the surface area of the box can, of one small box is 25, 5 by 5, how many small boxes can we fit only one layer deep into the large box? Draw a scale, a scale diagram. To demonstrate the packing arrangement, if the diameter of one round tin is 5 cm, how many cans can Sipu fit only one layer deep into a large scale? Draw a scale diagram. Fuyu wants to practice his mass literacy skills and rather calculate the area of the bottom and the large box and the small box. Divide the larger bo area by the small box to see how many he can pack. He does the following calculation. So he says, each small box is 25 square meters. 720 divided by 25 is 28,8, so it's 28 boxes. Is this different, and why do you think it is different? Oops. Next one, exercise one, investigating packaging arrangements. For activity, you need to collect a number of cans, measure the area of bottom of boxes and the diameter of the cans, Using the length and width calculation method from the previous work example, estimate how many cans can fit into a box. Through trial and error, find the best way to fit the cans into each box. Draw a top view of your final package arrangement. Compare your light with the rest of the class. 
Would it be easier to pack boxes than cans? And how do you know that the cans are cylindrical rather than box shaped? Hint, look at the shapes of the bases, right? Uh, there's another um, in week. There's a week um, estimating area, estimating volume, where this is also coming in. So you can go back to that week and look at the the videos. Right, end of chapter activity. Here is problem one, there's problem four, and problem two and three on the next page. So just to avoid confusion. Um, Robert buys a new TV cabinet and it comes with a four falling pictorial assembly. How many pieces of wood should Robert expect to find in the box that the cabinet came in? How many wheels should there be in the box? If the cabinet did not come with screws, how many screws will he need to, to put it together? The assembly diagram does not indicate what tools Robert may need. List, list two tools that you think he might use. For each step, give a re written description explaining what to do. Could the cabinet be assembled if Robert completes the steps in a different order? Explain your answer. Then problem four, if you want to post the package to your friend living in Botswana, the content or a brand of chocolate that your friend is struggling to find in the shops where they live. The following diagram showed what the chocolate looks like. You have to fit as many chocolates as possible into a rectangular cardboard box which is twice as long as it, it is wide. Suggest at least four different ways that these chocolates can be packed. Make use of sketches to illustrate each method. The chocolate weighs 100 grams. If the maximum capacity of the cardboard box is 2.5 kilograms, how many of the chocolates can be packed? If each chocolate costs 11.99 and you buy enough chocolates to fill the box to its maximum weight, how much will you spend on chocolates? If the cardboard box uh, costs you 10 rand and the shipping to Botswana is 40 rand per kilogram, how much will your parcel cost you? In total, including the cost of the chocolates, assuming the box weighs two and a half kilograms, what will be easier to pack cylinders or triangular prisms? Give a reason for your answer. And then problem two, this is William's flat. Identify the five symbols used in the plan. If the diagram above has been drawn to a scale of one to 50, complete the following calculations. So I've put in the measurements for the bath the width and the length of the bath, the main bedroom's window's width, ach, length, the kitchen sink's width, the bedroom's length, and the bedroom's width. William wants to put tiles into the room. Calculate how many squared meters he will need. Um, let's see the main bedroom. He wants to put it, okay, so here's the main, how many squared meters he need. The cost of the tiles or uh, th is three squared meters and they are 120 rand a pack. Um, William's landlord is charging him 90 rand per square meters for the flat. How much is his rent in total? For a birthday present, William is given a new couch. The couch is 1,2 meters wide and 2,5 meters long. Will it be able to fit into the front door of the flat? Oh, that's a good question. The following plan is for your friends. Problem 3, Currents layout for the kitchen. Identified five problems for this land in terms of placements of items. Motivate your answer. Redraw the plan with an improved layout. All elements present in the original diagram must be included in the improved plan. Okay, this is the last exercise for this uh, topic. Please complete it before you look at tomorrow's video.